right click properties so it's ready it's ready at fat 32 so what I need to do now is go to the ASRock uh, website yes I do use <laughs> Firefox um, go to ASRock uh, and yes my home page is amazon.com <laughs> so now we're going to scooch over slide on the motherboards or just going to, oh oh just go to support right there support mm, I know I know my motherboard name so X570 Tai Chi oi oi What just happened here? Oh, here, okay, this easier. Support BIOS update. So we're gonna go with the the latest update. So we're gonna go through. Since we don't live in China, obviously it's gonna be global. All right. So we're gonna save it. I ain't go further with it. So now I'm going to extract it. So let me see, video extract here. And then you're gonna slide it onto the mother, onto the drive. And then we're going to rename it. Step will be step four. And then I have to rename the file to creative.raw. So after I renamed it, this popped up, this window popped up. So I renamed it creative.rom and this popped up only because the computer doesn't recognize the ROM file, but that's okay. Cause we know what we're doing. So we're just going to hit yes. Now it's ready on the, now it's saved to the mother, uh, sorry, to the flash drive. All we gotta do now is just eject it. Right click, eject.